Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I want to show you how you can have a certificate automatically issued to your students when they pass a quiz that they've taken in Google Forms. So you can see my sample quiz that I have here on the screen. And we're going to use an add-on called Certifyum. Now, if you don't see it here in your add-ons menu, you can always go over here to the right-hand side, select Add-ons, and then do a search for Certifyum, as you see right there. So let's use Certifyum. We'll enable it in this quiz. And now over here on the right hand side, we'll see certification is off in our settings. So let's turn it on. We'll set our minimum passing score. And you can see by default it's 80%, but you can set it anywhere from 10% to 100%. You can pick a template. Now there are some standardized templates here. You can also use a custom template. And I'll show you in just a moment how to use a custom template. For now, let's just use the standard golden frame template. And let's take a look at a sample of what the template will look like when a student passes the quiz. So I'm going to have it emailed to me as a sample. I'll just go check my Gmail account quickly. And we'll see what that looks like in my Gmail. So there's my sample certificate. And we can see there it is. Passing score. And we'll see what the certificate says. Now that's a pretty boring looking certificate. So what we can do instead, you'll see there's an option here for use a custom template. We make the template in Google Slides. So we'll use here the Google Slides template for student certificate. Now you could build one from scratch as well, but in this case, I'll just use this template. And I'm going to change student name to full name. And down here, I can change the date. And I'll change the name that appears there and say Mr. Byrne. And now let's call this student certificate for sample quiz 123. And now if I want to use this template, and this full name piece is important because that's what's going to uh, replace full name with the student's actual name that's collected in the quiz under your name. We'll go in here and we'll pick use a custom template. That's the certificate I want to use. Choose select. And now we'll see on the right hand side, student certificate is the one that's going to be used as opposed to one of these standardized ones. So that's how you can create a Google Form quiz that automatically sends a certificate to your students. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com and practicaledtech.com dot com.